Yoruba group spits fire over menace of Fulani headsmen, charges Southwest governors. The Yoruba Initiative, TYI, a social, cultural, and non political group in the Southwest, has raised the alarm on the menace constituted by suspected Fulani headsmen on farmlands in the southwest and other parts of the country. It describes the unceasing encroachment as a threat to the economy and poses danger to the distressing national economy. TYI in a statement signed on behalf of the group by Mr. Folu Olamiti, Chairman Media Committee, alluded to the most outcries and complaints from farmers in Southwest, Delta, Southeastern states, and recently from Catholic Bishops' Conference of Nigeria, CBCN, in Abuja, on the havoc being wrecked by suspected Fulani headsmen on farmlands. The group against this background therefore called on the Southwest governors to take the problem as a challenge by collaborating with the development agenda for Western Nigerian to immediately develop an action plan aimed toward preventing further encroachment of farmlands. TYI in the statement issued on Tuesday said the federal government should urgently intervene by looking into the problems and dangers posed by the cows rampaging farmlands in the southwest and other parts of the federation, averring that the problem, if not curbed, has the potency to cause commotions and disaffections among ethnic groups in the country. The group noted that the grazing of cattle on farmlands in specific areas of the southwest by the herders had been discouraging the business of farming in the region, more so as farmers continue to counter their losses each time cows maliciously devoured crops on their farms. The group lamented that the effort by the federal government to diversify the economy with farming as a major anchor are already being defeated through the danger now being constituted by the rampage on arable land by cows, thereby rendering them useless for viable farming. Ventures saying, if it is continues, it will worsen poverty and food scarcity, not only in the southwest but also across the federation in the foreseeable future. The TYI counseled the federal government not to concentrate attention on the northern part of the country alone on agri-development but to spread such opportunities evenly across the geopolitical zones of the federation if Nigeria must truly emerge as a giant in agriculture while earning foreign exchange to grow its economy. The TYI counseled affected state governors to urgently consider holding a special meeting with the President of Nigeria, state governors from the northern parts of the country, well as the Umbrella Association for Fulani Headers to collectively fashion out ways to stop the rampage. The statement further said, the people of Southwest have long been noted to be highly accommodating they have been living peacefully with Fulani and other ethnic groups for ages until now that cows, for no just reason, are being moved with impunity into farmlands, Why herders show no slight concern to farm owners. We like to stress here that the impunity noted of the herders in destroying farmlands may have political undertone for now but such will never serve even their interest in the long run in the event that Nigeria gets destabilized in line with plans by forces that may be remote control, 
controlling the headers. TYI also appeals to farmers in all parts of the Southwest to be more security conscious and law abiding and to report any breach of security around their farms to government of their respective states. Thank you for listening to this news. Hmm. It is good that this is also happening in the Southwest now. I thought they said that the Fulanese are not are not truly disturbing the Southeast. I thought they said the Fulanese are good to to accommodate that they are not uh, they are not an issue at all that the southeasterners are just are just being wicked and greedy after all the 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 the, 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 the Fulanese equally accommodates the the egos in their own states you can imagine now it is happening in the west you can see how they are lamenting they have just started this is just the beginning the Fulanese have not really dealt with them they have not really done anything. They have just given them a tip of the iceberg. They have not really done a half of what, a quarter of what has been done to the Southeasterners. You can see just a little that has just been done to them. You can see how they are lamenting. What if they now do to them half of what has been done to the Southeast? How would they feel? So they can now, you can, they can now see what the southeasterners are facing from the hand of these hoodlums. They cannot see. So let this, the western people also experience it. Let them know how it inches the southeasterns. Let them to suffer it. You can see. You can see that these headsmen are not just a thorn in the flesh of the southeasterners, but also to other regions. People that can that can even be against themselves, not to talk of um, people that are not Fulanese. You understand? So I'm not surprised this is happening. Well, it's good. It's happening. Let them to face it. Let them experience it. You understand? Let them experience it. Okay? They 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 they, they, they were calling the southeasterners wicked and selfish people greedy people people with no sympathy and all of that now they are now facing it they have not even really done anything to them see see the see 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 how high their tone is you can see they are now calling all states in the all the community in south uh, in, in southwest to be security conscious <laughs> my viewers I will tell you that the Fulanese have not really started with the Southwest. They have not. You see, those people are the terrorists that 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 they are talking about. They are real terrorists. The, the way the brutal people in their farmland, the way they took over people's farm whenever they moving their cows in those in people's farm oh my god destroy people's farmlands people's crops allow their, their their cows to to eat people's crops what people have spent so much money in planting see these people deserve to be totally wiped away out of this surface of this earth you understand you can see see what they are doing to southwest now so my viewers your comments are uh, are very much needed in this uh, already read uh, news please don't forget to leave them behind click on the subscription buttons as well as bell buttons to get updated whenever we upload any new videos thank you